Hey friends, it's Sandra here at Here and Rich. Thanks for joining me today at the greenhouse. Just wanted to touch base with you because a lot of you have been in in the last couple weeks to buy your pansies, which is fantastic. We're so glad to see you all enjoying spring and gardening. However, I do want to give you a little warning. It's going to be a bit chilly this weekend. Now, pansies are cold tolerant, so I'm not, uh, it's not like it's a huge deal if you've planted them outside. It's, it's actually totally fine. Ours have been planted out here for a little bit. But I just did want to give you a heads up that if you're concerned about these pretty blooms getting spent over the weekend with the snow that's forecasted, um, just to give them a covering of either a blanket or a towel, something like that, that'll give them a bit of insulation. Don't cover them with plastic, okay? Plastic will not help at all. In fact, it may make it worse. You can cover them with an old blanket, an old towel, even a cardboard box will give them some insulation from the, from the uh, elements. Um, but even if you forget and these little guys get covered in snow like ours did two weeks ago when we forgot them outside, um, they'll come back. They're just gonna look sad for a little bit. So I've got a picture here of what our pansies looked like two weeks ago and what they look like now. And they've made a miraculous recovery. They did look a little crummy in the middle for about a week, but we just took some time and pulled off all of the dead flowers, which is a good idea to do for your pansies anytime. Just pull those dead flowers off and it really just promotes new growth. Other than that, pansies are pretty low maintenance. You just pop them in the ground. For the most part, Mother Nature takes care of the watering, which is a win, um, and they're, they're gonna look beautiful until you get ready to plant your summer flowers. Now, here's a little tip that I do. So my pansies I plant um, near my front door so that they look nice for the Easter and spring season. And then when it's time for me to put my petunias in those flower beds, I just dig them up and put them around on the north side of my house where it's a lot shadier and much cooler for them because pansies really don't like the heat of the summer. When I do that little move, I generally give them a little haircut and I find that in the fall, they're blooming beautifully again once the temperatures get a little more um, happy for pansies to thrive in. So that's my little pansy tips for you. I hope you have a fantastic day and stay warm this weekend.